Heck yeah! Mic is working. Audio is still on. Hell yeah! Hi everybody! How How's everyone doing on this wonderful Saturday? I have missed streaming on Saturdays. It has been a while since I streamed some art. And I'm so excited to, keep, to stream some more art. I'm going to be streaming a lot of art in March. So, get ready. Also, hello Geek Outs! Hi, how are you doing? I see that your aunt is visiting and you're grilling some hot dogs. That sounds delicious. What? Ah! Lemon! Welcome to the stream! Yes, we have a Brie. I am here. Um... You can 100% claim your dust. This is, uh, for those of you that don't know, um, there's these things called channel points or on my channel called fairy dust. And if you have enough fairy dust, you can, um, request me to draw a thing. It can either be a full color bust for 25, uh, fairy dust points or, um, for full, for 25,000 fairy dust points or, um, for can't remember. I want to say 8,000. Yeah, and for 8,000, you can get a quick doodle. So, quick doodles are about 20 minutes. Hello, Daydream Kitten. Welcome to the stream. It says out of stock. Well, it says you claimed a full bust. Why does it say out of stock? I will go check my dashboard. One second. That's important to fix. <laughs> important to fix for this stream because that's the whole point uh community channel points uh, full bus edit oh limited, uh, there's not a limited there's no limited redemption for stream what the fuck There we go. There we go. That should be better now. It said it had a limited redemption of one. That's not true. I'm also going to turn down the music a little bit. Ah, understandable. Um, well, I know you did it. I will see if my dashboard tells me. Come on, channel analytics, I think? No, stream manager. It did say that you had a full bust. Reward queue, there we go. Completed. That was completed. All right. Yes, and I still have the full bust. Yep. It says that you did a full bust. So. Oh. Same idea, and uh, but instead of just the mid shift transformation, you can draw Jane Doe slash Notably, however you want. I will. I haven't actually finished uh, Jane Doe before, so I will. Hey Haku, welcome to the stream. And again, oh, uh, thank you so much for resubscribing, Lemon. How did, how did five months of streams go so quickly? Oh, I must be having fun. Yay. I'm so glad you're having fun. And yeah, isn't that crazy? Five, me five months have already gone by. Five months have already gone by. And I'm pretty sure on the 17th, that'll be six months. I'm pretty sure. I could be counting wrong. If that's not six months, then it'll be April. I might have to change it. I don't know. I might have done my math wrong. But five months! Ah, crazy! Ha! Ah, hey, Jay Wilson! Oh my gosh, Finn redeemed his full bust. Alright, Finn, what do you want me to draw? 
I gotta make a, gotta make a list. Gotta make a list. Hi, Jay Wilson. How are you doing? They're mine. <laughs> you can redeem a full bust if you want, Haku. Or you can, if you, I'm going to do my best to get through all of them today. Man, it's been so long since we've done an art stream. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Also, mine. Okay, okay. You can keep them. Hoard them uh, like a fey dragon would. Creepy doll character thing. Oh, you're a creepy doll character? Sure. Just anything? Is there like any specifics that you want? <laughs> Alright, perfect. That sounds great, Haku. Also, I think this needs to be dead. There we go. Now I'm fully in there. Now you can see my bust. Was that a weird thing to say? I don't know. Oh man, it's actually been so long <laughs> since I actually, like... Because recently, in the last few days, I've just been cranking out, like, comic work. Because, <laughs> fun fact, uh, because February was so busy. February was so busy, I actually lost my buffer for... I had a four-week buffer. I had a four-week buffer for my comic. I was doing so good, and now it's gone. Because <laughs> I couldn't work on it at all during February, because I was just, like going 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 and then like the kickstarter oh and every just so much was going on so i couldn't actually finish the comic so then uh <laughs> so it's gone now <laughs> and so now my hand i'm now just been just working as fast as i can to get a buffer back for my comic eek Ooh. You started importing just to see if you can make a patch? That's awesome. Yeah, four weeks gone. <laughs> it was intense. So yeah, I've been like, I need, I need, I need my, I need it back. I need my buffer back. I stayed up really late on Thursday finishing page eight. Really late. Thanks, science, for the buffer. I know. So it's gonna be interesting to actually like do a bust. Ah, Super Voxinus, welcome to the stream. Hey, how are you doing? It is so wonderful to see you. How have you been? How has a work on the uh, video game been going? The updates in the Discord look absolutely phenomenal. Oh, you're welcome. Maybe I should whip out a reference, because I have drawn her a little bit. But yeah, I'm currently drawing uh, Jane Doe slash nobody. I'll just write it down. which is a character uh, that I play in uh, Geek Out's uh, Cyberpunk uh, 2098 game. It is a role-playing game, um, a t t tabletop RPG role-playing game with this cipher system. And it's so much fun! I love the game! It's so much fun! I didn't, I didn't think that I'd have so much fun playing Jane. It's, like, because I had, I, like, when I started this game, like, I had, honestly, no 
absolutely no clue. Absolutely no clue um, what kind of character I wanted to play. Um, and then I started thinking about like what would be like fun in the cyberpunk setting. And I was kind of just like, what kind? And we and then it turned out we were gonna be like doing sort of like a heist type game. And I was like, okay, what would be a fun heist per type person? And I was like, well. I really like Luma from, uh, I really like Luma from Callisto 6, changing your appearance and being, like, being other people is, like, a pretty OP thing to have in a cyberpunk setting, but also, I really, really liked, um, um, I also really liked, I, lo I completely lost my train of thought. Uh, Sophie from Leverage, which I actually started get I started uh, Geek Outs watching. And if you haven't watched Leverage, watch Leverage. It is so good. Um, but I started watch. Uh, I really like Sophie from Leverage. Um, which is she's like a grifter character who is like super good at like pretending to be someone that she's not. And like Sophie isn't even like her real name, and no one knows her real name. So it's like it's a really cool character. So like uh, Jane slash nobody doesn't have a name. Well, she does technically, but no one knows what it is. No one knows what her real face looks like, and she basically has like scrapped every record of her from the systems. And it's just until season three. Yep, until season three. I don't remember. I don't think the audience ever knows her real name though, which is the best part. Like the characters know her real name, but the audience never fucking knows, and it's great. Anyways, um, so I wanted to like mash up those two characters, and so I have a pretty, I have a ho I have a hollow grifter, uh, um, hollow grifter, uh, person. She, she can't actually like change her face, um, with like superpowers, but she can change her face with like hollow technology. Um, so she looks, she can change her face in hollow technology, and it's super cool. Anyways, that's this character, and I love her very much. But, um, I saw that Super Vox Voximus asked about my Kickstarter, and yes, the Kickstarter is launched. It is going so well. We only have a week left. Um, it uh, ends on, I think it's gonna actually end on March 15th. Um, I think it's said to end in, on March 14th, but I think it ends on March 15th because of Leap Day. Um, and so, it's a little, uh, off. But, um... Train of thought. Uh, yes, it ends in a week, but we only have a thousand dollars to go until uh, we're fully funded. And so, if you are interested and you haven't backed it yet, please do. Um, it is quite a lot of money, so if you aren't able to, I completely understand. Though, if you would like to donate, like kick it five bucks, whatever, anything, anything helps at all. If that's what you want to do, if you can't, totally fine too. Tweeting about it, asking about it, being excited about it in general is really great because maybe uh because actually getting this funded some hopefully we're hoping sometime down the line we'll be able to actually instead of just kickstarting the project we can um sell the project sell sell elemental spark in possibly stores or on an online store that we create or something because we are definitely going to have some extras um from this kickstarter run and depending on how things go and what we are able to do we might be able to have it other places. So, anything you want to give will super help, no matter what. And But if you can't, also, completely no worries. I totally get it. Just as Haku says, no one has to do something, they especially especially when they can't. No worries. But thank you for asking. It is going so well, and I'm so excited! I, it, I was just thinking about this today, but, like, I can't believe... Something that I've 
like I've made a I'm I'm making a comic and stuff, but like something that I did my comic is like a huge in undertaking and a huge endeavor and it's amazing. But with this board game project, it's kind of like something that I've created just freaking I I mean like, and I also, like, work with it. It's really hard to explain. It's just amazing that it's something that's getting done. It's, like, a huge project that I finished. Like, my comic is ongoing. Um, so I actually, like, finished a product and project and did all of the art for it. And all of, like, oh! And it was so, oh, it's so cool. Anyways, I'm just really happy about it. I, I love the setting. Thank you. I love the setting, Geek Outs. And, oh, new up, new update of Dustbenders is tomorrow? Heck yeah! If you guys haven't checked out uh, Jay Wilson's comic, Dustbenders, 100% do so. And Jay Wilson, if you would like to, you could, uh, or John Whistle, John, you could put your uh, co uh, link to your comic in the chat so everyone can check it out. Oh, and speaking of comics that people, um, speaking of comics... Do her lips real quick. Okay. Um, speaking of comics, uh, as I was saying earlier, I think, yes. Um, page eight of the Phoenix chapter two is out right now on Tapas, Webtoon, and my website. So if you haven't checked it out. Please feel free. It's a pretty fun page, I think. And, uh, yeah. It's a pretty fun page. And it has, like, some flashback bits. So, that's fun. But I will say that, um, I will say, I will say that next week, next week's page is gonna be freaking great. It's gonna be hilarious. Oh, I also hope that, uh, this week you notice that there is a, uh, you maybe saw more of a, a character that you haven't seen, uh, fully yet, so. You're gonna meet them very soon. Next page, even. Maybe. They are my favorite. I can't tell you their name, because spoilers. I talked about, I, did I talk about this on Thursday stream that I just, like, I can't be a DM because I want to tell everyone everything, and I just want to tell you guys everything about my comic so much. I want to just tell you everything. Um, but. I can't tell you their name, but they're cool, and when, uh, when people, when, if anyone watch, uh, watches Infinite Horizons, which is Rule of War's uh, new cyber system game that is freaking amazing. Um, when Caitlin was basically talking about, uh, her bug person, I got, like, super excited <laughs> for, a, for a reason, because I also have bug people in my setting, and they're, they are baby. <laughs> Morgan, welcome to the stream! It's really disconcerting that you call us delicious friends. Are you- do you plan on eating us? Is that- is that a thing? <laughs> You're not gonna eat me!
Also, we've gotten some more people since the beginning of the stream. So, for those of you who are not aware, uh, today we are actually stream. Uh, today is a fully commission, uh, bust fairy dust commission art stream. So, if you have any type of uh, if you have any type of uh, art that you want me to do, if you ha um, and you have the fairy dust points, uh, you can uh, drop uh, you can drop those fairy dust points, which is either uh, 25,000 fairy, fairy dust points for a full colored bust or 8,000 for a quick doodle. Um, and I'll see how fast I can doodle in 20 minutes um, for 8,000. But this whole stream is just you guys using your points if, you, if that's what you guys would like to do. And I'm currently drawing um, Jane Doe, which is a character I play in... Um, uh, Geek Out's, uh, Cyberpunk, uh, Seattle 2098 Cypher System game. You're at 32k? Haku! You're here too much. You are here too much. Not that I want you to leave, but jeez! Also, hi, Hairthulu! Thank you for telling me that Hairthulu so says hello, Daydream Kitten. Hello! Woo! Hate Hunt redeemed a quick doodle! Yee! I'm a hoard them. <laughs> Come back at least from doing the hoard reference now. <laughs> it's a reference I shall never explain. All right, Mr. Penny. All right, I'll do a quick. I'll do a very quick doodle, Mr. Penny. Um, should I, do you think uh for do you think I should drop everything and do that now, or should I do that? a different time or should I wait I think I'm, I'm eating a late lunch so I'm just lurking hi Morgan yes have some lunch <laughs> you're gonna make a fairy out of it you're just gonna hoard all of those all of that fairy dust all right, I think I'm gonna finish the sketch and then I'll do mr. penny real quick However you prefer. All right, sounds good. Craft a fairy out of some fairy dust. I admire your tenacity. <laughs> Hello, Hair Thulu. Thank you for lurking. Oh, you can actually hear me today. That's great. Those eyes kind of look pretty an- Those eyes look very anime. Like, sad anime. <laughs> I might have to- Bam, fairy. You gotta mix the dust with glue and paint, and then you get a fairy. That is, that's how fairies are made. Not from laughter, but by having fairy dust and glue and paint. Don't kill your hand while you embroider. That's bad. Don't do that. Sad bam, guys. Yes, yeah, seriously. I don't actually really know what her outfit looks like. I kind of forgot. I know all I know is that she has a pearl necklace. It's a which is a hollow emitter. Laughter is <laughs> Q said anime piano music. <laughs>
boob window. Because all good cyberpunk people have to have boob windows. Even the men. Everyone has boob windows. It's the highest of fashion. <laughs> I'd also like an imp. <laughs> make an imp instead. Imps are good. I've heard that you make imps out of blood, though. Especially the men. Exactly, Lucas. Especially the men. Also, hi, Lucas! <laughs> All, everyone, everyone in the side, everyone in any cyberpunk setting needs to have a boot window, no matter what. That is a sketch done, so that means <laughs> that's okay, you're welcome to lurk. I feel like today's a very good lurky stream. I can get blood. Oh god, don't get no, don't get blood hawking. Yikes. I'm contemplating cooking the fish I got today, considering it's almost eleven PM and I am now considerably drunker than before this fight not be good. <laughs> Maybe don't cook while you are drunk. I mean, there is a show called Drunk Kitchen that they don't die, so could be okay. Right. But I need someone to make an imp. <laughs> I mean, don't harvest someone else's blood. Unless it's like there, it's unless it's freely given. Don't just stab someone to make an imp. No, no stabbings. I don't condone stabbings here. All right, Mr. Pennies. What the fuck? All right, twenty minutes on the clock. Okay. <laughs> Good. Don't set your kitchen on fire. Nobody make. <laughs> no fun for you. I'm sorry, okay? I can't, in good conscience, tell you to stab people. Though, I have a feeling in saying this, Finn is gonna come in and stab me with something. He has, he's cleaning, as I said, probably on Thursday, he's cleaning his room. And, um, this is, like, pi like, he hasn't cleaned his room since he was 11? I think. <laughs> um, I don't think he's cleaned, cleaned his room since he was 11. And so that means that uh, everything from all of his Nerf guns, from his preteen Nerf gun phase, and all of his wooden weapons that he got at uh, various Renaissance festivals throughout his life, um, and all of the knives that he has, and all- just. He had oh, he's coming in. He does have a weapon. I heard he's gonna stab me with his newest weapon. They can't see it on the screen. If that's ah, he has a lightsaber. <laughs> Knives out. Exactly. Nah, it's not an old weapon that he cleans out of his room. It's the newest weapon he got for his birthday. Use it as a nightlight. You use it as a nightlight. It's loud. Like it makes noise. You can turn. How about turn off the light? Ow! My ceiling's low. Wee! Lightsaber. Oh great! Thanks, Finn. <laughs> You sleep with it next to your bed? In the corner. That's such a fin thing to do. You have knives literally hanging in front of your desk. I what I mean I had knives. I don't It is a cool saber. He got it at Galaxy's Edge when we went to uh Disney uh for his birthday this this well not for his birthday. Birthday Christmas time. But it was also New Year's. Oh, 
when I went to Disney a few months ago. <laughs> what does he have? A knife! <gasps> Alright, now I'm actually really gonna do Mr. Petty's. Jedi Brie is a cool image. Aw, oh, thank you. Yeah. I don't, like, Finn, like, even if he was in the Star Wars universe, Finn wouldn't want to be, uh, Finn would want to be a bounty hunter. He wouldn't want to be a Jedi. I want to be a Jedi. I want to have a cool saber. Mm. That was Lemon. You guys have the exact same color. I was just looking by color. Thank you, Lemon, for saying that I'm a cool Jedi. It was for the Life Day celebration. Exactly, Lucas. Huh? I think I showed them the cube a while, but I can show them again if you want to. I'm trying. I keep getting distracted. Good job. This is the Kyber Crystal Cube. Wow. It's glowy. I think it has the, I think currently the white kyber crystal, we have all of the different colors of kyber crystal, because we kind of went ham, um, but this currently has the white kyber crystal in it, which is Ahsoka's voice, actually, and I was so excited, I love Ahsoka, Ahsoka's my favorite character of all time from Star Wars, Ahsoka's like the coolest person ever, because it, the white kyber crystal could have either been Ahsoka or uh, the blind guy from Rogue One. Um, the force sensitive blind guy from Rogue One, and I was like, please, 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 please be Ahsoka, please, she's the coolest. And while we were, ee, and when she was in, um, and when we were just like waiting in line for another ride, we like opened up the Kyber Crystal in this cube, and I put it in there, and I like held it up to my ear real close to like make, and, and like I heard a woman's voice, and I was like, yes, woohoo! I was so excited. <laughs> I love Ahsoka. Yes, of course. Ah ah Ahsoka should be everyone's favorite character. She's, like, the only one that makes, like, legitimate sense in the crazy world. Everyone else is like, what are you doing? Why? What are you doing? Well, that's kind of a bold statement, but I love Ahsoka. She's great. What is that? This, I don't know what it's called. There was a special name for it, but it's basically like a me like in the Star Wars canon. It's basically like a memory cube where uh uh if you by putting a kyber crystal in it that a Jedi put their like thought or like a Force user put their like mem. It's basically like a memoir reading a holocron. That's what it's called. It's a holocron, but unlike um in Star Wars, there's not like a hologram that comes out of this. Um, it's just a voice. But it's cool! And it emits light. And I'll show you the kyber crystal. Ah! Don't fall. Kyber crystal. They even have- they're like- the kyber crystals actually like- they're plastic, but they look like they're crystal-y. It's kinda cool. It's definitely Star Wars PhD. Yes you do, Lucas. I'm aware. You only have two, uh, I only have two knives. Where did my pen go? Did I nab it? Oh, here it is. Oh! Hey, oh my gosh. Hey, hun, thank you so much for gifting. Oh, why is everything quiet? Why didn't I hear that? That was weird. Did you finish? I have not finished, Jane. Um, there we go. No wings not allowed. <laughs> yes, welcome back to having wings, Lucas. Also, thank you so much, Morgan, for gifting a sub. Uh, no, Jane is right here. But, uh, Hate Hunt, uh, gave, um, asked for a quick doodle. So, I'm gonna do a quick doodle real quick. Alright, and I'm actually really going to do it. Going to focus and do a quick doodle. 20 minutes on the clock. Start. Oh wait, I should probably look up. Everybody pause. I'm gonna look at I'm gonna look up a reference image for Mr. Penny's.
Mr. Benny's. There we go. There's the boy. There's the good boy. I don't, I won't be able to get it very detailed, but I'm excited to try. As I'm very proud of Cecily taught my, taught my profession. Yes, Haka, you've trained, you, Haka, you have trained Morgan so well. Their anatomy is weird and fun. I had no idea what was up. Yes, now you can honk and have an overlord. Yay! Alright. Um, how do I do this so I can both see the chat and also see Mr. Penny's? Perfect. There we go. Alright. Now, I start. Boink. This is gonna turn out so poorly. I'm just warning you. Crap, what do I only have the top? How do the legs look like? Ah! That just flew right out of my mouth. There we go. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. There's the full body. Resume! I'm just gonna go for like the mo I'm just gonna go for the basic shapes. Just gonna go for the basic shapes here. <laughs> This is like speed drawing. I like that these like, I like that these doodles have become more like, they're just like basically just a challenge. So I see you, Haku. I see you promoting my red bubble. <laughs> That's basically him already. Oh, good. He's like a, he has like very weird anatomy. But yeah, you guys are actually getting to see my ability to draw from reference, which I'm honestly pretty proud of. They drilled that into me during they dr drilled that into me during college. Is that a weird way to link it? Is that a weird way um, to, to phrase that? I don't know. I remember having to do like, um, like in like anatomy classes, like we had like challenges to like draw things in, like now draw this thing in like, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get the other, so like here, oops. You had to draw things like so freaking like faster than you'd want to, just too fast, just too fast. Like 
get, like, the basic form down in, like, under a minute. It's not pretty, but it's getting there. I, oh, I still have 14 minutes left. Heck yeah! I might actually get to, like... I might be able to actually... Wow. I underestimated how fast I could do this. I think I'm just not gonna draw his arm. That's fine. It's fine, it's fine. Anything I don't want. Actually, I'm gonna move this up a little bit. There we go. If I can, like, if I can ink this boy in 13 minutes, I'm gonna need, like, a standing ovation. This is, like, Get your honk ready. <laughs> Punk warming up my good hoarding bug son. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. He is he is all of our sons. He's all of our son. I 
still have 11 minutes. Guys, what is happening? How did I get good at this? How did I get good at this? Maybe it's because I've just been cranking out uh, comic stuff in the past few days and I've just been like really good at furiously finishing something. I'm also like not caring too much about if it I'm actually gonna care about the tail, though. At least, in a way, that. He wants to be created. How, how am I? What? Who am I to deny him to be created? I mean, there's no way I'm gonna get as detailed as Hate Hunt's uh, work on this because have you seen their art? It's just freaking phenomenal if you want to see like an, a much better picture of this good bug boy check out mr penny's mr penny's twitter and also ask them about the bits and bobs that he sells because he sells some cool stuff and it's all based on memories and things and it was all conceived right here on this channel Ooh, really? I am? Dang. If Magnus, Magnus were here, I could, like, this could possibly even count as, like, someone in doing a thing in someone else's style. You're, a, you're also just, like, a lot more detailed than I am, though. There's, like, a big rock here. Connected to these bones somehow. I'll just. That's how that works, I guess. Um. Just going for it. I am going for it. can't distract me right now, Finn. I'm in the middle of something. Foot. That, that's a foot, I guess. Foot. Did I miss anything? Did I? <gasps> Did I do it? Oh my gosh! He is a sketched! Can I color it in six minutes? You have got the color right here. Shh! Okay. The scribbling comes from the soul and possesses your arm. I mean, you're not wrong. It's too blue. 
That's better. Yes, there is an Ash baby. Baby is here. In the background. Because Finn is trying to distract me. I'm speed coloring. I hope this is entertaining to watch. This feels like a race to me. It's a 20 minute race. I hope it feels like a race to you guys too. They can't see you on this camera, Finn. Huh? Okay, cool. Does that want fish? I don't know. She probably does. I got fish. Well, maybe she wants some fish. We'll see. I don't know if I don't know if you're able to give it to her. Can you teleport here? Is that a possibility? That's too. Where's a better brown? That's too. There. Two minutes! Bones! Oh, that's a bag. Bones! The brown still needs to be better. I only have two minutes. Man, when you're challenging yourself, you can get a lot done in 20 minutes. Wow. Wowie wow. can do it. Thank you. I think I've got a minute left. I'll give this bug boy some highlights.
He deserves some highlights on his soft carapace shell. I mean, it's not soft, but whatever. I'm really proud of this. How did I do this so well? How is that possible? Ben, what are you doing? Don't make me come over there. Ben. What you doing? You rascal. And time! Done! Dismiss. Time! Woo! Mr. Penny's has been completed! <laughs> Look at that! I inked, colored, and sketched in 20 minutes. How did I do that? Is it, are you giving me Ash as a celebrant? How about- Yay! Look at all of the honks in chat! Ah! I've got Ash as a celebratory present. She's like, please leave me alone. <laughs> Woo, my son, yay! It's like we completed a challenge in a video game. I like, this was like, achievement unlocked. Compl pretty much complete an entire uh, art piece in under 20 minutes. Woo, I can't believe that actually happened. I mean, I didn't talk to chat at all. I will get caught up. Wow. Look at that. It's, it's Haydon's son. It's Morgan's son. I kind of want to, like, show the reference image. Like, side, side by side. But, and Ash wants no part of this. Oh, man. But, in that rush, it also kind of helped. I drank a lot of water before I went live. So, I kind of have to use the bathroom. Um... I think I'm gonna take just like the briefest of breaks. Like I'll be back. Maybe Finn will come in. Oh, Finn! Did Finn knock over like so many things in my room, trying to get Ash to? Oh, whatever. Yes, I'm gonna take a, just the briefest of breaks to go to the bathroom, and then I will show us side by side. Yeah, this was also. It seemed like a race to my body because I really have to pee. <laughs> I was challenged on all levels. Alright, um, I'm gonna, I'm just, yeah, I'm gonna take, like, the tiniest breaks. I don't think I'm gonna go off, I'm just gonna, like, leave, I guess. Finn, I'm gonna, I don't wanna leave dead air. Maybe we'll just show Pua again. Alright, I'll be, like, right back. I'm still here. Enjoy. Finn! Knocked over every he knocked over everything. Knock over Look at my mirror. Come and entertain the folks. Come and entertain the folks. My hair is terrible, so I just took a bath. Hello. You, you know, I'm too tall, so you can't see my hair good enough. Hello, folks. Oh god. I don't know what to talk about. Uh, yeah, Bree did drawing. Um. Yeah. Hello, hate hunt. Oh, not hate. Yep. Oh, yeah, I got a haircut, uh, last week again, and it's good, except when I actually get straight out, because it just gets all flat, like that, which is not great. Hey, Lemon Twist. Hello, everyone. Thanks for the haircut. Uh, and Geek Outs, I'm doing good. Bree's chair is just too... I know, I'm just trying to get... Roll it. Every time I try rolling it forward, it just ro starts rolling back. Uh, there we go. A little bit better. Um, oh, Bree's desk is so small. I don't think Bree has ever shown people what her desk situation looks like but it's a very small ikea desk like four foot long but she only has like two and a half three feet maybe 
that she can put her legs in. Oh yeah, Bree did a, did do a drawing, and it she has to go in at an angle because she has her uh, TV like her old TV next to it, so she has a very cramped area, which is great for just drawing, but like not great for anything else. Yeah, it's it's basically on two milk. Crates. It's, it's not on two milk crates. It basically is. No, it's not. It is. It's very small. I she know. Has a... Okay, I got this desk when I was like 13. You didn't grow though. I haven't grown. I haven't <laughs> grown. <laughs> grown. I haven't, I haven't uh, got any taller or bigger really since I was in seventh grade. So hey. I stopped in seventh grade. Like I said, she has a. More cramped than my room. It's super cramped. I know. But yet, somehow my room is cleaner than yours. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, Gron? Yep. Gron. This reminds me of Source. Alright, I'm back. Source. Fucking goofy. Oh. Source? Source? There's a good. Oh, this is still too much. Oh, there we go. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> That's what you had it at. I didn't no, I, I made it higher okay. so people could see Pua. Got it. Anyway, I'm back, everyone. Thank you for letting me have a small bathroom break. Um, I'm going to show uh, side by side, just because I'm really proud of this. Um, and I'm also cue Fast and Furious music. Dun -dun -dun -dun. Yep. Thank you. Haircut. Yes, Finn got a haircut. He actually got a haircut for his birthday. Oh my gosh, I have to show you a very good photo. I I I done did stop growing. <laughs> I did I done did stop growing. You are correct. Alright, I have to show you a very good photo, but I'm also gonna download. I'm all over the place today, guys. I'm so excited to be back streaming on Saturdays. Okay. Just gonna bring. Oops. You can show them. Just come here. Just show them. Show the. Show. Look at Finn's got. Oh. Finn was inspired to get his hair cut, like the uh, like the person in uh the new. What is it called? Uh, Star Wars, uh... Fallen Order? Yeah, Fallen Order. Fa Fallen Order? Yeah. He was inspired to get his haircut like the new Jedi, the Jedi in Fallen Order. Oh. I don't know. I don't know his name. I haven't played the game. You don't have? I also don't have the game. But Super Tondra 4x4 does. Hi, sweetie. How are you doing? A good recap for you did drawing. I did. Um... Let's see if I still have it. Some photos from the va the vacay. Oh, Disney. Yeah. Which one? Oh. My, my, the best series of photos I've ever taken. Finn Jedi guy. That's the name. So Jedi Finn too. Nice. Yeah. I think we both be pretty good Jedi. Yeah. I still. You Finn would be a much better Jedi than me technically, because he can actually he's actually trained in lots of sword fighting techniques. Don't co you went defensing for years? Yeah, that's only one. Okay, but you've also like done things with like katana fighting. I taught myself in a day, basically. But that's a that's still cool. Like you've watched videos on how to do it. I look at pictures. I look at the pictures of how to swing. I'm like, oh, I get it. Yeah, Finn's really good at that type of thing, and you're also really good at parkour. Don't also you went to classes for this. I did, but I'm you, not great. He's li never... he's literally trained in these things. And he's like, oh, I'm not the I'm like, oh I he's literally gone to classes for this. Then I was like, maybe he's into research. That's true. I'd be good at that one. Finn's at the Finn's good at the fighting. Someone else that likes the fighting. We can be Ahsoka. Okay, but she's not a Jedi. A, a force Okay, a force you okay. Someone that has a lightsaber. <laughs> <Hank>. <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> if you want to be technical about it, someone has a lightsaber. Anyways, I have these really good, I don't know, hopefully, Daniel, is it okay if I show your face on here? I was, I, I just thought about it because of Finn's haircut, but I don't know if it's, I mean, I think it's okay. You showed it, it's on your Twitter. It's on my Twitter, it's true. I think it's okay. Mr. Pennies, yes, hi Nico, welcome to the stream. I'm just gonna wait for Daniel's confirmation. <laughs> but, um. But his picture's also on the website, on the Kickstarter. That is also true. His face is everywhere. I mean, I'm just trying Not to there. get consent. How do I show it back? How do I? What? I'm trying to show it in a way, like, in a way that it's possible to show it back to back. Uh, oh, lower the opacity. That's, I guess. Nah. Like, if you hold it up to it and then you change the opacity, then you can be like, this is. That's true. I'll make it a little bit bigger. Your proportions are a little bit. I'm aware of the proportions. I did this in 20 minutes. Let me be I'm... proud. No, you Hello, delicious, it. juicy friend. Consent is mandatory. Yes, it is. Daniel was. I'm just asking Daniel because he was here. He's here. I saw you. Was he at work? No. Okay. It's Saturday. Well, Why would he be at work? It's Daniel. It's a good question. I mean, we have a Lucas. Yes, we have a Lucas. Lucas is a here. Lucas is a here. There, that, that looks much better. Oh, my hair. Oh, what? <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. What, the, the, the screen? The screen just went fuzzy. Yeah, that happens sometimes when I touch this. <laughs> Hi, I'm here. Yes. Okay, but this is Mr. Penny's. This is uh, Morgan slash Hate Hunt's drawing of Mr. Penny's. And this is my drawing. Morgan spent so such a good time on this drawing, and I'm it's such a beautiful drawing. And then this is mine, which I'm still really proud of because I did it in 20 minutes. But it's look it looks pretty dang good. Also, it kind this kind of looks like an animation that like Mr. Penner just kind of like stood up, <laughs> just whoop, just stood up. <laughs> yeah, decided to have a little. bit a little bit better of a posture. <laughs> it's the old one. Yeah. Aw, oh, thank you, Lemon. My, my, uh, drawing from reference skills have come in handy. It's the best photo, it's the best two photos. I'm gonna text Daniel. If you're not gonna answer me on stream, I'm call gonna Daniel. text, I'll just call you. Or that's a cool shading. Dang. <laughs> well, I, that's the one that I, I just scrolled really fast through Twitter, and that's what I found. All right. But that means we have done the quick doodle from Hate Hunt. Yay! I'm going to save it. Nope. Save. Yes. Mr. Penny. Um, I started drawing Jean. I haven't finished. This is the only one that I finished. This was a quick doodle that I finished. I started drawing Jane, who looks extremely anime. Very, very anime. I have a different... I'll show... Oh, bitch, sweet eyes. I know, yeah. a different yeah. style of eyes. Your faces are very anime, except... Oh, so I forgot that was plugged in. Yeah, type, C, type C, so it should be fine. Yeah, it's fine. I forgot that was plugged in. Where is it? Procreate. Well, you could also do that. This is another. This is another uh, one of Jane that I did, that I started. This is what I'm going for. I think that this one is a little bit better, but I will use this one as a reference. But yeah, yeah, that's what I'm going for. Also, why'd you turn that off? Player. Ah. You 
help you can figure out how to choose games from your iPad onto your computer. Like, onto your computer. That would be nice. That would be cool. Thanks, Ben. You're the one that touched it. I know. I tried to fix it. <sighs> Alright, back to our regularly scheduled programming. Huh? I do have a schedule. I have a, I hundred percent have a schedule. Don't make fun of me for not having a schedule. I work meticulously. Show them your Google calendar. I don't want to show them my Google calendar. What are you doing? I'm just wiggling it. Okay, the nose is pretty good. The eyes are weird. The mouth, I mean, in general, it's pretty good. I don't know. The eyes just look too anime. I will have to change those. I'm sorry, eyes. Goodbye, anime eyes. You've done me well. Goodbye, sad anime eyes. There we go. That's bet. That's a bit better. That's less sad. But um, now that we're doing regular, you could go for a stylized black bar on the picture. Yeah, I was thinking of doing like. I was thinking of doing that. I don't know, because she's going to have the hollow things over her, but I do, I, I do like the, I think I might do both. I might do the eyes and then do like, nope, that was supposed to be fill. good. You made me extremely bad achievement pop up? What? With a marker, kind of like that, except with a marker style brush. Yes. That was just the fastest way to do it without changing my brush, brush size. <laughs> Drost and the Furious, sketching in color and drawing in 20 minutes. Congratulate. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, I have an achievement. Achievement unlocked. That is so sweet. Thank you so much, Morgan. guys uh done and tweeted and we'll pass that down oh thank you so much for hanging out lemon twist it was so great to have you and i'm super excited to see your clear skies pick oh i always love seeing clear 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 skies pick it's honestly so much fun and i hope you have a absolutely wonderful sleep bye
Please don't eat your desk, and please get some fish. Yes, if you're hungry enough to eat your desk, I suggest you get some fish. Does that eye look weird? I feel like it looks weird. Ooh, that does sound good. That sounds delicious. I love salmon. Yes, please report. That sounds delicious. And my music stopped. Salmon's delicious. There we go. All right, I think that's a good sketch of Jane. WordPress. A link. We are now in, we're now art streaming because now I can touch links. Ooh. That'd be awesome. I like that a lot. That is a great idea. I, I actually like that. That, that would be some killer party makeup. I love that a lot. That, ooh, that's fetch. <laughs> Stop trying to make fetch happen. It's on a Wednesday. It's a good thing I'm not wearing pink.
how have you guys been doing the last past week? I've been having a pretty interesting week. It's been, it was my birthday. I almost forgot that that happened. It was my birthday on Tuesday. And it was pretty dang, it was a nice, it was a very nice birthday. I had an introvert day, as Daniel would call it. Um, and then this week was kind of like a weird mix of working and then not working and then working and then not working. I don't know. I just, this week was a very, like, I'm so used to just like working all of the time that like this week that I, when I didn't have to do that, it was very strange. I mean, I still worked like quite a bit, but it wasn't like a constant stream. But then, you know, on Thursday night, I stayed up extraordinarily late. Later than, later than, um, even Critical Role is on. It was like 5 a.m. Central Time. You could probably look on Tapas and Webtoon when, um, the page was, uh, released. It was, like... 4.30 a.m. That's pretty much, and then I went to bed right after that. Introvert day is a mess. Wouldn't that be, oh my gosh, an introvert day as a, an actual holiday would be so nice. Like, can you imagine not ha ex being expected to like talk to people
It's not, it's not here. I don't know. John hasn't um, reached out to me to hang out this weekend, so I do not know what he's doing. But that is okay. I do not know where he is. With lead up days on December 4th, 6th, and 8th, 10th, and 12th. <laughs> I mean, we also lucked out in having like two birthdays so close together. I think John's was in November. Is it was in. was in crap was it in january i can't remember <laughs> we do we have a whole year to wait to get to nico's birthday Not a whole year. Like, you know, nine months. That's okay. It's worth the wait. I thought it was our first, I thought it was our first session. Or maybe our second session. I don't remember. I'm so bad at remembering things. Yours is in August. Cool. Well, we're get we're, we will get there sooner than Nico's for sure. I wonder. I wonder if December fifth is a Tuesday. <laughs> The pan's hot and the fish is sizzling, folks. Yay! Sizzling hot fish. We love sizzling hot fish here. Oh, I just saw uh, Jay Wilson. If you're still here, I don't know if you are, but if you are still here, I just saw your uh, your chat. And you said that insert uh, name minifest will take place on July 25th. And I did know that. I have a flyer. And I haven't, obviously, because applications and tables haven't opened yet. But I am planning on doing it. Because that sounds like a lot of fun. Oh my gosh, I just saw Lucas! I just saw, I'm, go, like, because I remembered that I uh, list a lot of chats while I was drawing earlier. And I, oh, I, I, oh my gosh, I'm so excited for you to uh, give me the sketch that you were saying, you were telling me about. I would absolutely love it. I'm so excited. And I'm so glad that you're, like, inspired by my drawing. That is so sweet. And what, Geek Outs, you said that, uh, you, I got you drawing maps and stuff again? That is... That is so sweet. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad I can inspire you guys. Cause, oh, I'm so excited to see all your guys' creations. Oh my goodness. That makes me so happy. Yay, you made a lot of progress. Yes, I can't wait to see it. As long as time continues in a literary fashion, yes. Yay. I'll be the first to read it on so unfortunately now. Dang it. Also, my files are lying. Dang it! Me and John both got our birthdays on a Tuesday. That would have been... It'd be hilarious if all four of us had our birthdays on a Tuesday. But, alright. That is the inking phase. Done! I think 
think the face shape is very different. But that would make sense. That is okay. I wonder if I can make the face shape more simple. There we go. That's a little bit more similar. Yeah. <laughs> I'm way happier with it now. Yay! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to see it. I can't, obviously, we can't tell anyone what it is, but I'm so excited! I'm so freaking excited. Hey, I just realized less than a, uh, one week to the start of the city that always hears. Yeah! Less than a week! Oh man, I'm gonna have to brush up on my character. I forgot. Oh my gosh. I'm so, oh, there's so many cool games going on right now. You don't have any idea what you're care. I mean, you're gonna be a magician, right? What? Well, it's it's just people's, people's characters. And they're not they're kind of cool. What is it? Is it the thing you made mm -hmm. yesterday? Ah, fuck. No, I don't want to. It smells weird. Mm. Ooh, some. Ooh, look at that nice crispy fish. Yum. Crispy fish. He did tier one differently. That is true, he did. I don't want it. No. I am rude. Remember that. And that's too pink. That's the red that I want. You had apple pie and a vanilla ice cream for dessert? That sounds delicious. That sounds legitimately delicious. I haven't had apple pie since apple pie season. But during apple pie season, oh my gosh. Um, I had like, we went to an apple orchard here in Minnesota and it was, the, it's called Pine Tree Apple Orchard. A great apple orchard. It's really cool. It also has like a corn maze and I think in the summer strawberry picking or something. I don't know. It was really good. I was, I was telling a story, and I completely just lost track of it, didn't I? Um, apple pie. Uh, we went to an apple orchard. It was great. Um, and I got a really deli- They make, uh, they have this, like, bakery thing. Um, and they have all the different types of- They, they have, like, their own cider. And they've got, like, hot cider, um, cold cider. They got all their different types of stuff. 
all the different apples. They have, like, pumpkin stuff, because they also have a pumpkin patch. Um, um, but they have, like, the best apple strudel, like, ever. It's so good. It's my favorite. They also have these really awesome cookies. They are, um, apple oatmeal cookies, or, um, chocolate chip oatmeal apple cookies. They are so good. It's my favorite cookies ever. They're delicious. You've never been to an apple orchard before? Really? Wow. Is that just like a Midwest thing? Because it's like a it's like a standard here. There's there's apple orchards everywhere. Okay, it's a WA thing too, that's good to know. Yeah, there's apple orders everywhere. It's like, the th it's like a th the thing you do before, um, you know, in the fall. It's like a nice fall treat. I mean, usually it's like, most people do it when they have like kids or like group of friends, but I think it's still fun. I'm very arid. Was like part of Texas when we moved in arid. Ah, I see. You don't live in a lush forest. <laughs> what, Finn? Hi. Oh, bye. You're going to work. Got it. Finn's going to work. This is going to be a Jane Doe, but party version, as uh, Nico suggested. And I do see your comment. I will do that in one second. Um, we had two seasons in Odessa, Texas. Hot and fucking hot. <laughs> we had two falls. Sometimes when the summers got too into 110s, the leaves would fall off because it was too hot. Oh my gosh, really? I didn't- wow. I didn't think that that was a thing that would happen. That's kind of cool. Um, and Nico says, do you mind telling him how the character creation went for you, Bree? So I don't have to type it all out in chat right now. If you, if that's if you remember. Um. Okay. Um. I kind of remember. Um. Basically, uh, we. I mean, for the actual like creation process, it was mostly along the lines of we kind of talked about what kind of character I would want to have. Um. It's the kind of like. I'm gonna change something real quick. There we go. Just changing her skin color a little bit. Okay, um... Sorry. Pardon me while I itch my eye standard of my life my eyes itch all the time um but with the character creation process we kind of he kind of asked me what kind of character I'd want to play um what sort of like my life was like um what our, my her personality was what her hopes and dreams were 
a lot of the a lot of the game is like very very based on hopes and dreams, um, which is why it's called the city that always dreams. And um, when it came to like powers and like the kind of character we'd want to pl- we'd want to play, we kind of like fitted into like what her dreams were. And I have to re- kind of remember what her dreams were. I remember like her like vast type of dream and like her power shift type of thing we're gonna have to go over it again just like a maybe we'll i'll maybe we can have like a meeting sometime uh nico just to like make sure that we're both on the same page about it um uh but her like so we kind of like started and like kind of thought of what our power like what her power at the beginning was going to be and like how it would ramp up um And so just kind of like how it would build on itself. And then we kind of created tiers based on that. So, and then at the end, we gave it a, like, a name. What our, like, soul was. What our soul name was. That is how I remember it being. And so we kind of, like, thought of things in that area. I think, just as, like, sort of, like, I don't know if this is for it. I don't remember exactly. I think I'm an adept, is what I think I am. And so, yeah, I think I'm an adept. But yeah, I think the foci is the, like a very good, important part. I don't, I don't remember the specifics, but that was just like generally how we created it, and we kind of like took things from abilities and foci and kind of like worked, with, like worked with it a little bit and made it a little bit different. Oh, you're back from the plane that you've been someone to. Welcome back, Haku. Um, uh, ooh! Yes, please DM me the sketch on Discord. I'm good. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna look at it right now. I'm gonna look at it right now. So I can freak out about it on air. When you, Whenever you DM me, I'm gonna be just so excited. Lucas, I'm so excited. Right. That is true. That is, I remember that. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I, I looked and it didn't have it. I, I, it's okay, Lucas. It's okay. I'll chill. I got so excited because he said, I'm not going to wait. I'm like, <gasps> I'll look at it right now. But don't, it's okay. I can wait. I can wait. The focus will be completely custom and you don't have a type. Yeah, that is also true. It was confusing, and it makes it made sense at the time. I just forgot the specifics. <laughs> Whoops. Um, I think I'm gonna tweet. We're almost at uh, the two hour mark. Oh yay! We're gonna, we're almost at the two hour mark, so I think I'm going to tweet out the stream again. It is sent. I will look. <gasps> Woo, Lucas, that's awesome. I love it. You are just in terms of, I don't know if I can say what it is, but in terms of the type of design and type of thing you're drawing right now, you are much better at uh, the anatomy of that than I am. 
because if you've seen uh the phoenix the ship it's kind of it doesn't make a lot of sense <laughs> so it looks so cool so cool Um, you'll be able to freely choose type-based abilities as you tier up, as long as you make can make a convincing point as to why you'd have them and um, how they would manifest. Yes, it's very custom. It's very customizable. Since the campaign is going to be mostly social encounters with only occasional and mostly optional combat, I don't want anyone to be locked. Oh my gosh, Nostracast! Welcome to the stream. It's been so long. How are you? Want anyone to be locked? Most people type. Yeah. I'm, I am very, I'm very impressed, Lucas. Good job. Full two thumbs up from me. Even. <laughs> Cheer, yeah. Honks of approval for Lucas. Honks of approval. Two thumbs up. <laughs> what bat? Oh, it's the TwitchCon Amsterdam. Got it. Of approval. Hi, Mr. Cast. How are you doing? How have you been? Hey, woo! Hello! Also, what is this music? I think. This is very not the type of music that I signed up for. Playlist. Why are you sad? Why are you sad, Nostra? TwitchCon? Oh, did that get canceled? Or did that get canceled or was it not fun? Oh, it got canceled. That sucks. I I get that. That sucks. I'm so sorry. A lot of things are getting canceled. And I think both are possible, Haku. Or, or, or for similar reasons. What is a good, ooh, charcoal pencil. That could be good.
stupid corona, yeah, stupid corona stuff. Kind of busy with, um, kind of kind of fun in drawing nowadays. Oh, sweet! How has, uh, Final Fantasy XIV been going? Did that already come out? Is that, a, or is that a new, I don't know. I haven't, I'm not caught up on Final Fantasy, no, that was Final, the remake of Final Fantasy VII is the new thing. Yes. I don't know if I like that. We do have a Discord! You freaking did it! I, we have a Discord now, Nostro. So if you want to join it, um, please feel free to. I don't know if you've been here since we've had a Discord. I made it with you in mind. You are a culinary god? Oop, that's too big. Where's the art gallery? There is an art gallery. It says gallery. I'm pretty sure. Welcome! Yeah, it's called gallery. It's in the guild hub. So, my Photoshop froze, so we're just gonna have a big smudge on her face real quick. Oh, and Daniel did say I could show a picture. Okay, you guys remember when I said there was a, an, a, when there was absolutely an amazing photo that I had to show you and I haven't shown you yet because I needed consent? I'm going to show you now. So, on the trip, there is a series of two photos that are the best photos I have ever taken of human beings. Let's see if I can show them on here. If not, I will download them and bring, bring them in here. Okay, so here is a photo of my, da of my dad, my brother with his newly cut hair, and Daniel, my boyfriend. We went to Disney. Um, this is in Galaxy's Edge. This was back when we were talking about Star Wars, um, and Finn's hair. They're drinking the, like, um, like, the weird- they're drinking, like, the- the blue milk type stuff. So here's them taking their first sip. And this is them after taking their first sip! <laughs> I- I, like, I was just trying to, like- so here's- The look of just, like, disgust on all of their faces. <laughs> it's the best photos I've ever taken. <laughs> Anyways. The best photos. Yay, you posted some stuff. I can't wait to see it. Hashtag regret. <laughs> I didn't have any because I was feeling pretty nauseous. Oh my gosh, did I tell you about the day? <laughs> um, let's look at Nostros. Oh my gosh, no, that is, look at you. Look at all the art you've been doing. More petting required. This is, look at this. Your art is, wow. I really honestly love the, like, the black and gray, the white, uh, the, the, the gray and red one that you did. That's beautiful. That could be, like, is that, like, a logo for something? Because I love it. This is all so good. This, that's so good, Nostro. <laughs> that is absolutely amazing. With the shirt design, I love it. That is really good. The 
it's a, a baller shirt design. Okay, is, are you, nope, it's still frozen. Come on, Photoshop. Come on, Photoshop, I believe in you. I have herby garlic salmon, crisp onions, and buttery couscous. I have transcendent. That sounds really good. Oh my gosh. That sounds heavenly. I wish you could cook for me. I'm such a bad cook. <laughs> I reacted. Yes. Anyways, that I'm just those. That was the best photo. Two photos I have taken of any human being because just. I wanted to get their I wanted to get their initial reactions to the blue milk because I had heard like some people thought it was like really good and so I wanted to like actually like see if people thought it was any good or if anyone on my thing thought on my family thought it was any good and it wasn't necessarily like bad but it was like that was a face of like I wasn't expecting how that tastes <laughs> and like they finished they finished them but I wanted to get their initial reaction and that was their initial reaction and I was so proud of myself for capturing that picture and like immediately I, I sent it like immediately after I sent it to my best friend um, her name is Hannah by the way uh, I sent it to her and I was like oh my gosh I was like please look at this photo it is the single best photo I've ever seen AC Gamer welcome to the stream hi So, uh, I was, I was very happy about it. Very happy about that picture. Um, and I, I didn't have it. I, it was something that I wanted to have, but I didn't have it because I knew it was going to be, like, milky and things, because I didn't, and, but, um, that, that day was actually kind of, like, the worst feeling day I, I felt on the vacation because I, um, don't do what I did, folks. I, so we had, it was a really good beginning of the day. We got there pretty early. Um, we went to Galaxy's Edge and had a pretty good time. And it was really fun. Um, and then we had lunch. And a fun thing that, uh, to note about Disney's dining plan is that, um, if you are 21 years or older, you can get a, you get, well, everyone gets either a free drink or dessert with, um, their quick meal. Which is like, uh which is like a lunch type thing with their lunch. And I, um, but if you're 21 or older, you can also have a free alcoholic beverage. So for every meal, uh, I had an alcoholic beverage because I was that was the first time I was 21 at Disney. And I was like, I kind of like, they have kind of some cool alcoholic drinks and I kind of wanted them. So I, um, I had lunch and then I, uh, was drinking my alcoholic drink and, um, Right after lunch, me and Daniel were scheduled to go on the rock and roller coaster because Daniel had never rode it. He wanted to ride some like actual like rides instead of just doing like experiential stuff. So we were gonna go ride that. And so, but I am an extremely slow, um, extremely slow eater and also an extremely slow drinker, especially when it comes to alcohol. I like my body. I just like I like sipping. And so, <laughs> um. I, uh, we had to go rush to go to Rock and Roller Coaster, so on the way there, I basically chugged my alcoholic drink, um, and I was feeling okay, um, but then I also, because of that, we were waiting in line for a little bit, I really had to pee, um, and so we were waiting in line, and everyone was, like, taking off their, like, everyone was taking off their, uh, hats and things, and I told you, because it's a Rock and Roller Coaster, it goes, like, to, like, zero to sixty in, like, 0.5 seconds, um, nothing, like, super bad happened. Don't worry. I didn't throw up and I didn't pee myself. Don't worry. That didn't happen. It was, I was too afraid, uh, I was too afraid during the rock and roller coaster to let my body do anything. So don't worry. No, no accidents happened. But, so I got on the rock and roller coaster. Um, and my dad had described the rock and roller coaster as just going fast. It wasn't, uh, it was just a very fast roller coaster. And I was like, okay, I can handle fast. 
Um, turns out it was my dad hadn't ri- wrote my dad hadn't ridden the rock and roller coaster in about twenty years since I was born. Um, so I uh, got on the rock and roller coaster and I was kind of like nervous because I was like I don't usually ride roller coasters. Um, but I had my glasses on, and so we went zero to sixty, and it was like Aah! it was like terrifying. I didn't expect it to be that terrifying, but it was terrifying. And then it immediately goes, makes you go into a loop. It immediately goes right into a loop-de-loop. But you're going so fast that, like, it doesn't really register. But my glasses started flying off of my face. And I went, like, I was, and then I grabbed a hold of them. Like, I was like, oh my god, oh god. And it was, like, going so fast. And it was really, really dark. And you couldn't really, like, see anything. It was really dark, and all you could see, like, sometimes was, like, like, the neon, like, road signs, because it's, um, you're supposed to be, like, in a really fast car, um, you're in, like, a really, really fast car, and so you just see, like, these neon glowing road signs, but, like, I was, like, gripping my glasses, because it was, like, flipping us every which way, and it was super pitch black, and then, like, at the, like, and I don't usually ride roller coasters, so I was, like, freaking out the whole time. And it wasn't necessarily that bad in retrospect, but then right after I got off the roller coaster, I was like <sighs> trying to like stave off like a panic because all of these things were happening at once. But I I stood up from uh, your uh, but I stood up from the rock and roller coaster, and uh, I almost immediately fell over, like almost like I was so so dizzy like I I couldn't walk in a straight line and I didn't I wasn't drunk I was just so freaking dizzy like my the the alcohol made me super like alcohol makes you dizzy like that's kind of like how it is and but then I also went on a roller coaster and so like I was so dizzy that Daniel had to like hold me And, like, we had to, like, walk out of the rock and roller coaster. And then, like, we immediately found a bathroom. And I stayed in there for, like, ten minutes. I was like, oh, my God. And I was so nauseous. I was like, oh, God. Oh, God, no. And I, I was, I, it was fine. Uh, and I was like, it's fine. I'm fine. It's okay. And so we, like, slowly walked back to Galaxy's Edge. And I was like, uh we were waiting and and so I was like doing better I drank a whole bunch of water I was like okay I'm feeling a little bit better but I wasn't perfect and then we wait and we started to wait in line for Millennium Falcon and that was like an hour wait so I had like I thought I had like a good amount of time to like get the like alcohol out of my system and uh I didn't really have to go to the bathroom that bad anymore and I was like I was like okay I'm fine and then we go on the Millennium Falcon um, ride. And that ride, uh, for those of you that don't know, it's kind of like Star Tours, if you know, if you've ever rode an, uh, rode on that ride, but you're actually controlling the Millennium Falcon. And so you can, you, so everyone has, there's two pilots, two gunners, and two, um, crap, there's another thing. Engineers. There's two pilots, two engineers, two gunners. Um, and since I was in the front of the line, um, just, that's how we, like, that, me and my mom were in the front of the line. We, uh, were given the, uh, we were given the, uh, pilot, um, card. And I thought that was gonna be fine because, gen- like, I, also another thing you should know about me, I get very motion sick. Um, <laughs> I get very motion sick. So, um, I was like, but I don't get motion sick when I'm driving. So I was like, okay, if I'm piloting, maybe I won't get motion sick. So I was in the pilot seat. I was like, okay, this is okay. But um, it was not okay because you're not really piloting. There's, like, things that you can pilot. And, like, if you don't, like, (laughs) if you don't um, do it, like, super well, you, like, run into things. And that's, like, eh, it was a thing. And, but, like it's space travel and it's like very good at like simulating the space travel and like I was like and I, since I was a pilot I had to keep my eyes on the screen I couldn't close my eyes and not think that I was going up and down and all which way and so I was piloting and for like the, la- the latter half of it I was like holding my mouth because I was really afraid I was gonna 
I was really afraid I was gonna puke. So I'm just piloting with one hand doing this while, like, my mom was, like, screaming and everyone was, like, doing things. And I was just, like, trying so hard to focus and not puke during this ride. And then we got off. I was still extremely dizzy. And then afterwards, we tried... It was super packed, too. So, like, there was nowhere to, like, lie down. Um, and, but we found, like, we walked, like, all the way over almost to, like, the Moo Juice area. I'm just gonna call it Moo Juice, like, the blue milk stand. Um, and so there was, like, a, like, a, there was a bench, and I literally laid down on that bench for an hour. <laughs> I was, like, I can't do anything. I have, my body is, like, what did you do to your navigational system? <laughs> um... Uh, why, why would you do this to yourself? You went on two nauseating rides, drank a whole bunch of alcohol, and, um, what are you doing? So I stayed on this bench for, like, a solid hour. Uh, my mom and everyone else was, like, went to get me water, and, but, um, and Daniel was there, like, stroking my hair, and I was like, I'm sorry that, I was like, I'm sorry that I, like, took out, like, an hour chunk of your day, because I have to, like, sit here and not puke. Um, they went to, like, do other things, and but I was, like, laying there for, like, an hour. <laughs> Funnily enough, we actually- there was actually some pretty, um, it was pretty, uh, interesting because, um, there- they also do, like, those, like, character things, and, like, Kylo Ren- like, we were sitting, like, right next to the, like, the door that, the, like, the cast members go into after, like, they do, like, a show, and so Kylo Ren passed us, like- a solid six times and harassed my dad as they do and it was pretty funny so at least there's that um but that's why i didn't drink uh the blue milk because i didn't want to puke <laughs> that is my story that is my fun uh, disney story and i was like oh so because i mean i had never ridden the rock rock and roller coaster i had never ridden the new millennium falcon right galaxy's edge is a new thing so i didn't have any precedence for it and a lot of times when you ask someone like uh a lot of times when you ask someone these types of like what is this ride like or is it like scary is it will it make you throw up excuse me will it make you throw up that type of thing um generally if they don't have like your types of conditions um they'll be like yeah it's fine like my like eight-year-old sister wrote out it and she loved it i'm like does your eight-year-old sister, uh, need to, like, stop the car and puke out of the side during road trips? Does, like, do you, uh, get nauseous on cruise ships? Because if so, I, you, you don't understand. So that's why I don't ride a lot of rides in general. Um, but yeah, that's my story. That was my really sick day at Disney. Nothing horrible happened, but I just felt kind of gross, and I just made a series of really bad choices. Anyways, that's my story. And I wasn't- I would like to just pause it that I, I was not drunk. I did not get drunk. I promise. That wasn't the thing. I don't get drunk after just drinking a cup of alcohol. I am better at constitution than that. It was just not a fun time. But I will, uh, now read your reactions. I've seen some of your guys' reactions. Um... But I also just want to say hi, AC Gamer. I wasn't able to say hi because I started talking about my story. But um, also, I'm really, really happy that you're drawing something that you're happy with. And I hope whatever you're going through will end soon. I hope you have a really nice rest of your day. And if you're still here, hi. Um, <laughs> um, no, yeah, baby, no, I know. I made some, a series of poor decisions that day. Uh, I will be an unkillable damage machine. Oh, and also, I'm an era Cobra, so fly speed plus rogue bonus, action dash, baby. Oh my gosh. You gotta go fast. I think someone made that joke. Gotta go fast. So when I'm playing a level 20 Tiamat one-shot, and my friend is running, I'm playing a Zealot Barbarian 15 slash Slockbox with Rock of Rogue 5. I'm very- Oh my gosh. That's insane. You are- Wow, that is a- That sounds like a really good combo, Lucas. Uh, oh, I'm playing an air cook. Oh, yeah, an air cooker monk slash rogue would be great. Air cooker monk would be good. So then you go really fucking fast. I just want to play a fast game. I just want to, like, 
break the sound barrier as a monk. That's all I want to do. <laughs> There's a video I watched to see what the theoretically fastest thing can and it was like in, in one turn you move around a mile. Oh my gosh. In six seconds you move a mile. That's insane. It's my min slash max heart. <laughs> um Pretty baby why? I'm sorry. I'm sorry I did these things. Um, Ruth's story reminds me of my 22nd birthday where I drank enough to allow myself to be convinced onto a tire swing. Long story short, I can no longer see a tire swing without feeling sick. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's sad. I'm, turns out lots of beer plus tire swing is a really bad time. Yeah. Drinking and going on anything that moves is a bad idea. Especially if you get motion sick. It is a bad idea. Let my story be a warning to anyone that wants to drink and then go on big rides. Don't do it. It is a bad time. Wait, we're both wearing C6 shirts today? Yay! I just pulled it out. Yeah, I'm wearing a C6 shirt today. I got this one for Christmas. I didn't actually think... Uh, I was able to grab it. I, like, I didn't have the money to grab it at the time, but my mom bought it for me, apparently. And so, I have a C6 shirt. It's the only C6 merch I have. And then I also have, last Christmas, I think I got the Lark Sage uh, cream soda shirt. So, I'm set for Gen Con this year. Don't drink. Good. That's adm admirable. That is very admirable. I ate a whole bag of spicy Cheetos, threw up, I threw up purple, ooh, ooh. Luckily, the first time I drank, I was, no, yeah, should I tell that on, on a streaming platform? Maybe not. But, the first time I drank on my 21st birthday, I did get a little buzz. I've never, I don't think I've ever actually gotten drunk. A lot of my friends want to get me drunk just to see what it's like. But I have a feeling that I will fall asleep before I'm actually legitimately inebriated to a way that, like, I can't drive. It would be, I'd have to legitimately, like, they'd have to force me to stay awake. Because after a certain threshold of drinking, I just literally pass out. I'm just, like, not in, like, the, oh, I'm, like, I black out. It's, I fall asleep. I'm, like, hmm, I'm feeling nice and calm and chill. Time to take a nap. Yep. <laughs> so, I've the most I've drank in one sitting is two glasses of wine. And I got a little tipsy, just a little bit. And mostly when I get, mostly drinking, I just get really giggly. It's like I'm on laughing gas, and then I take a nap. <laughs> I'm not that fun drunk. I luckily don't like the taste of alcohol. That's true. You don't like wine. And that's a majority of what we have. What do you like? I also like tequila. Tequila's good. Daniel likes rum. And I know that most people, I'm sure a lot of people like rum. But Daniel likes rum. And it tastes like gas to me. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm going to have to force close Photoshop because it's not responding anymore. We'll see what happens. Fofos, welcome to the stream! Tequila's pure evil. <laughs> I just like it because it's good in mixed drinks. It's awesome for me a few times a year. Oh, that, if that wine makes me giggly. Yee. I like wine a lot. <laughs> when I do, I just go to sleep immediately. Understandable. Understandable. Come on, Photoshop. I don't want to have to open Taskmaster. Hey you, how are you doing? How, how has it been? I'm streaming on Saturdays again because I'm not busy on Saturdays anymore. Yay! I can drink, you can drink tequila like water. I mean, is that a stereotype? I don't know. But I applaud you. Yeah, I'm, I don't like whiskey, vodka, or rum. I can drink vodka if it's like that much vodka and like that much lemonade.
I had way too much wine last night. <laughs> Panic. Yeah, I can drink that much vodka and that much lemonade. Yeah. Anything else? I can't have rum. I will taste the rum. I'll taste the whiskey immediately, too. I don't like it. I dropped the needle. Oh my god, don't don't hurt yourself. Yeah, and it, it smells like, it smells like rancid gas to me. Like, at a, it smells like gas station to me, those, vod those alcohols. <laughs> I don't know. Was it apparent in Discord? Wow, AC Gamer, that's beautiful. I'm, that looks amazing, AC Gamer. That's so cool. Anyways, alcohol. In like three. Uh, white. I, I like it because it tastes more like fruit. I'm the stereotypical white girl. Let's be real. I've never had minced wine or whatever, and I've been told it's very good. Hmm. I've never had minced wine either. I've had spiced wine. That's good. Cider is also pretty good, too. But most ci most alcoholic ciders are fizzy, and I can't. my tongue can't handle fizzy stuff. I'm going to have to force close this. Um, let's see. Um, let us see. I have to close Taskmaster because this is... I mean, I have... Taskmaster, where are you be? Thank you, Nico. Um. For 600 seconds, same. Mead is... Oh my god, I love mead. Mead is delicious it is so good it tastes like honey it's so good i love mead how do i open taskmaster yes i love mead mead is so good uh where is mead where's mead where's taskmaster goodness um I just I've been able to open it before, but now I just have forgotten. I have forgotten how to work my computer. <laughs> huh. It's probably in settings, right? Search Does anyone know where Taskmaster is and how to get there? I feel like an idiot for not knowing. <laughs> this boy. Come on. Oh my gosh, Ninja Penguin! Akemi, you're here! Hi! Welcome to the stream! Thank you so much for... Thank you. Hi. Thank you. Also, uh, Morgan, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Ninja Penguin. That is absolutely beautiful and amazing. 
I'm in Japanko and welcome to the brigade. Control Alt Delete. Okay. There it is. Thank you. Photoshop. End task. Okay. There we go. Task has ended. Thank you guys. How have, how are you doing? I have I have no alcohol in but like places that have fancy mixed drinks that don't make me feel like I'm twelve. <laughs> yeah, same. I feel you on that one. Um, let's see. Now back to Photoshop. Let's hope that there is. Uh, I should have saved pretty much. Let's see. There we go. <gasps> oh, thank you so much for following Ninja Penguin. Thank you. Hi, Kemi. How are you doing? If on PC, yes, me. What is your taste profile for alcohol beverage and free? Taste profile? Um, I like uh, mixed drinks. I like pretty much anything that's like fruity. Um, anything where I don't usually have to taste the alcohol or if I don't taste the alcohol. Oh my god. Morgan, thank you so much for gifting us up to Fofos. And Fofos, welcome back to the brigade. Um, this is like the inverse of tech support. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I'm glad you found the needle again, Haku. <laughs> yes, you did. You weaseled till the- there we go. It is back. Photoshop is back, guys. Our- though, the, um, there we go. Photoshop is returned! Okay. Come back from war. Though, with a little bit less work than I had. Um, yes, you did weasel your way to the top of, uh, top, uh, to the top of week gift leader. So, get congratulations, Morgan. Um, But yeah, my, I like fruity things, um, in general. Pretty much anything that I like. So I like wine. Um, reds are pretty good. Um, I prefer whites. Sweet things, usually. Um, I want it to, like, taste like a treat rather than, like, to get me drunk, you know? So, like, cocktails. I also and really, really, really enjoy Bailey's. I know it's that's a whiskey, but it has, like, cream and chocolate in it. Um, so, uh, so that is very delicious. And it's really, really, really good in, um, hot chocolate. And it's, like, one of my favorite things to make in the winter. Um, I will be streaming until 7, which reminds me that I should probably take a break pretty soon. Because we're almost halfway through. Yeah, I, well, we are halfway through. We are over halfway through. Um, yes, I'll be streaming until 7 today. So yeah, white wine, white wine, mead, Bailey's, and martini, not martinis, margaritas are my favorite types of drinks. Yay! Yes, please. I can't wait. Yes, go make some food. Take care of your corporeal form, Lucas. The caramel one is... I have never actually had the caramel one. I've only... Um, the only Baileys I've ever actually had is the one that um, Daniel bought for me for my 21st birthday. Because he turned 21 before me. He turned 21 before me. And, well, it's because his birthday is before mine, so that would make sense, but still. Yes, so mostly sweet and savory. Yeah. True, true, true. 
I don't like beer. I don't like anything that fizzes either. But that's for any drink. Ooh, Dooley's. Hmm, that sounds good. That does sound good. A toffee one. Dubliner whiskey liqueur. I will have to try that. Because that does sound pretty dang good, if I do say so myself. are so itchy. Flask cider. Ooh. Any. I would totally, totally drink a uh, flat cider. That sounds very good. Just recommending me so much alcohol. Ginger wine, it's an old person's drink, but it's amazing. The downside is the speed at which it is. Ooh. Huh. I've never considered having ginger wine. I don't usually like the taste of ginger, but that's interesting. <laughs> Drunk stream. <laughs> Only if I want to. Yeah, I mean, I could try. I mean, I'd probably when I play, it'd probably be when I play some video games, honestly, because that'd be more fun and I'd have to stay awake. Um, but... As I said before, I don't, I'm, my, uh, drunkenness is mostly just giggly, and then I fall asleep. <laughs> but it does sound fun. It's for all the inactive beasts right this season, and then chat can see other chats and streams. No, don't, don't worry about it, Haku. You can do whatever you want. Also, I hope embroidery is going well. It sounds awesome. Okay, cool. someone and take a liquid <laughs> hydrate haku what are you doing party games with stream and shots yes Jackbox, like Jackbox, but with, um, Jackbox, but with drinking, with drinking. That would be interesting. It's going pokey, but I'm getting there. Good. I'm glad that you're getting there.
see in the past 10 minutes you have made... Um, once upon a time I played WarioWare driving, WarioWare drinking games. Oh my gosh. That is pretty fun. What? Uh, are you aware that Stupendium made an Untitled Goose Game song? It is delightful. I did not know that. What? Really? That's awesome. Stupendium made an Untitled Goose Game song. That is so cool. Can you send me a link to it? I'd love to watch it. Did have a Smash Bros. drinking game, but we made a mistake with the rule and the loser had to drink, which meant once you started losing, you, ca you kept losing. <laughs> ah, I see. Loser had to- yes. Yes, it's generally the winner has to drink. So it becomes an even playing field. Run off with your onions, fuck that stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's amazing. Ooh, oh my gosh, I'm gonna, I'm totally gonna watch that after the stream. That is, what a foul day. Yes, that is awesome. I am so excited to watch that. You don't even know. Sorry, what the? That's you! Pardon me. <clears throat> also, thank you so much uh, to my wonderful moderators for getting rid of a troll. That has never ha that's never needed to happen before, so I'm so glad I have you guys here. <laughs> Thank you. I ha I picked the best mods for the job. It you 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 guessed right. Morgan. <laughs> yes, slay away. Say, slay away, Haku. But hey, at least it means that I made it as a streamer. I finally had a troll. I'm now c what you would consider famous. <laughs> That's not true. It was just one guy. It wasn't a big deal. But yeah, I've made it. I finally got a troll. <laughs> That's the significant... That's the sig... sig signif That's the... The sign that I've made it. Different name. Ooh, you're taking boats. I I did. I do already have a cult. You're right. I've already got a cult. Might as well get a troll. <laughs> yes, give the good boy a pet for me. Oh my gosh, whoa.
morning! Hello, everyone from Harry Thulu's stream! We got a raid, everybody! Hello and welcome! Hello, Harry Thulu! Hello, Daydream Kitten! Raid! Hello, Ma Hello, uh, Mango! I'm assuming that's how it's pronounced. Greetings! Hey! Was here the whole time. I know you were Daydream Kitten. Hi! Welcome! Welcome, Raiders! Um, since we actually have some new people here, um, you're in both chats the whole time. I mean, I would expect nothing less from you, Haku. Mango! Oh, shit, that bad. <laughs> Just Mango. Okay, Mango. Welcome, Mango! This is my fa- uh, Mango, this is my favorite streamer. Aw, thank you! So was I thinking of you guys. You multitasking geniuses. Rated, not jaded. She's so cute. <laughs> um. But yeah, so. Mango, thank you so much for following! So for those of you who are new and don't really know what's happening, um, I am currently uh, drawing your suggestions. Uh, if you have uh, uh, fairy dust, which are my channel points, uh, if you have 8,000 channel points, you can request a quick doodle from me. And if um, you have 25,000 25, channel points, you can get request a full color bust. A lot of my regulars have 25,000. So I'm kind of trying to like get through them today, so. Aww. Morgan, thank you so much for gifting us up to Hair Thulu. Also, Hair Thulu, welcome to the brigade. Oh, thanks, Mango. I hope you enjoy my art. You also do art sometimes. What kind of art do you do? If you'd like to, you can join our. You can join my Discord. No. <laughs> you have thirty. Yeah, you have thirty-three k Haku. That's insane. She's the one and only. I am the one and only. No, I don't do it. No. Oh. Hate Hunt. Morgan, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Mango. Mango, welcome to the brigade. If you... That was my call. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm glad that you're here, Mango. I am the one and only overlord. Too slow. <laughs> yes, but yeah, we have a Discord. So if you would like to, uh, if you do do arts, if you don't do arts, that's totally okay too. But if you would like to, you can please, you can join the Discord, um, and pretty much chat with us, uh, talk about all the types of things that you enjoy, uh, show showcase the art that you do, anything. Yes, there's so much love in here. You are, I know you're already in the brigade. You were, you were technically. Just welcome back, I guess. Welcome back to having wings. It's a very, we, we try to cultivate a very wholesome, uh, place over here, but not wholesome and, like, kid-friendly. Don't worry about that. We were just having a very long conversation about what alcohol we enjoyed. <laughs> Yay! I'm glad you joined. Yes, you can now honk. Alright, I think, now, I think we're going to... Oh my gosh, we're at 20 viewers! Hello, everybody! Um, for those of you that don't know who I am, my name is Brie, uh, Brie, Don Brie Daydonin, um, or at Brie Donin on Twitter and Instagram. Um, I am a illustrator and comic artist, um, who creates, um, pretty much all, all different types of art. Mostly, uh, fan art of my favorite shows, but I also work on the... SGD, or the San Gennaro Co-op uh, Short Game Digest, um, uh, with Bopos and Basilisk, who is not here. Um, and I also uh, make my own comic called The Phoenix. You can find a link in the you can find a link in the chat somewhere for sure, or uh, below my face um, in the Twitch area. Um, or wow, there's a lot of different things. Um, I also have a coffee, uh, you can donate to me also here, um, I also have a Redbubble, 
um, where I sell stickers of all the emotes on my channel. Um, so if there's any emotes that you have that you would like in sticker form, probably the honk one, let me be real, um, you can get them there. And I also, oh, I also am an artist on a board game that is on Kickstarter right now. So if you like playing board games and also like my art, feel free to check it out. We are going to be on Kickstarter for another whole week, so... We're almost fully funded. Oh my gosh, we only have like a thousand left to go. I'm so excited! And that is my quick spiel. Woo! I did it. Which you just mentioned. Yeah, you did. I've been trying to like... Which I've been trying to... I'm sorry, I'm not caught up on chat. You guys have been just overpowering love. And I had to give my spiel. It's so fun to play. Oh, I'm so glad you think it's fun to play. I've had a lot of fun. Oh, thank you. Thank you for giving a rundown before you raise someone. I didn't know that. Oh my gosh, Hannah! Hello, welcome! It is pretty terrifying. How are you doing? Welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Oh, Hey, hun. Thank you so much for gifting a sub to Hannah. Hannah, welcome to the stream. Welcome to the brigade. It is ter pretty terrifying. You can now have a whole bunch of honk emojis. To the brigade. The brigade. Yes, that's, that is, that is who we are. I'm so glad you caught one of my streams too. It's so great to have you. Everyone's just, do you have too much money? Yeah, I know. Right? Both ha both Haku and Morgan just shall give people gift subs. They hate seeing anybody that doesn't have a wing in this chat. What can I say? Okay, cool. Yeah, if you want me to call you Marks, I will totally call you Marks. If you also, if you guys have anything you would rather me call you rather than your uh, screen name, please let me know. I'll probably alternate just because that's how my brain works because I read the thing. But when I remember, I will call you your real name. So I will call you Marks. Hello, Marks. Nice to meet you. It's more of a, it's less of a sniper rifle, more of a Gatling gun. You're right. They're just shooting it to see who will get it. Send 20 bucks and making people happy once a month. Aw, that is so sweet. I know Haku since we were kids, so yeah, she still uh, gives me too much gifts. <laughs> oh, Morrigan, thank you so much for gifting us up to Daydream Kitten. And Daydream Kitten, welcome back to the brigade. I hope you like your wings. <laughs> Yay, wings! Everyone everyone can fly now. Everyone's flying. <laughs> here, Thule, you definitely belong here. It's not, we're not kid friendly. We are wholesome though, but you still belong. Everyone belongs, unless they're being trolls, then they don't belong. For those of you that just joined, we had our first troll today, which is kind of crazy. Kind of crazy. We had our first troll today. That means that I made it. I made it as a streamer. I have a troll. I think I'm so glad you like the pattern on her outfit. It's okay here, Thulu. I completely understand. Disney troll stories. <laughs> um, I, I, there's a, uh, hey ma, hey look ma, I made it. Yeah, exactly. Hey look ma, I made it. So yeah, I made it as a streamer. I got my first troll today. I'm happy about that. Yeah, 
That's true. I agree with that, Nico. I was just, you know. It is a milestone. But I will not give them any more love. Because I know that's what they want. Here come all the geese! <laughs> yes, we will raid. All of the geese are coming. But yeah. Also, for the uh, geek house, you said that you like the pattern. I really like the pattern, too. It's a... I don't know. It's a brush that I found. This is what it looks like up close. It's a brush that I found. Um, it's a Kyle T brush from Photoshop. It was like Photoshop's summer free brushes that I got. It's really cool, huh? Wouldn't that be great? Like, this would be such a cool outfit, right? What do I use? To, I use Photoshop, if that's what you're wondering. I use my uh, Photoshop as a program. Um, that is the program that I use. I also use Procreate. Um, I'm actually uh, using... Uh, uh, I can't do this. I use Procreate on my iPad. Because um, it can actually become PSDs. Um, but if you're looking for, uh, if you're looking for, uh, drawing, digital drawing things for you to use, um, that don't cost any money, I highly, uh, recommend Krita, uh, Krita, K-R-I-T-A, or Clip Studio Paint. I've heard really good things about those two things. And Clip Studio Paint, you do have to pay for it, but it's only, like, a one-time fee. You don't, you have to pay for it once, and it also goes on sale quite often. Uh, thanks, Haku. Yes, that's true. If you want to see other arts that I've created, uh, feel free to check out my Twitter or follow me on Twitter. Um, I post art there pretty often. Um, I should probably po po be posting more recently. I've been really busy, so. But I'll definitely be posting this uh, later. For sure. I gotta get to Finn's creepy doll, so I gotta keep trucking. Yeah, no, no problem. You're using a fire alpaca. Oh, cool. I've heard of that one. How do you like it? That's true. Gimp isn't bad either. I've heard more people be kind of like meh about Gimp, but... I've also heard that some people really enjoy it. Especially for like sprites and stuff. I use paint.net when I make stuff. I like GIMP, but it cried. Yeah. There's so many different, like, things you, to use. And I only learned that after I started using Photoshop and got used to it. So now I'm kind of, like, stuck in Adobe hell. You know. You know how it be sometimes. Yay! Welcome back, Lucas, with delicious food! It's actually quite good if you have a tablet. Oh, cool. That's awesome. Take some getting used to, but if you are willing to spend some time learning how to use it, it's basically Photoshop for free. Yes, that is why I recommend Krita. Um, it's it's a lot like Photoshop. It's a lot it's a lot like Photoshop and Procreate, which are uh, from most professional digital digital artist standards, kind of like the two the two big ones. Most artists that I talk to use either Photoshop or, uh, uh, or Procreate, but highly recommend Krita and Clip Studio Paint as well. But that's why I said that. <laughs> yeah, it's 100% free. Krita is 100% free. And if you have any Apple products, uh, Procreate's only ten dollars. Most 
of my artist friends have Procreate as like their main, at least, at least mo most of my artist friends that I met in college um, use Procreate. Do you, do you use uh, Krita Haku? Thank you so much for following. That reminds me, I should probably tweet out my stream again. One, real quick, I'll do that. Use Twitch more. It's a I I use Twitch pretty frequently. I mean, not not just because I'm a streamer, but because I also watch so many other streams. I watch. I I mean I don't know. Is it? I spend probably too much time on Twitch. To be fair. What's a D&D 5v combat gauntlet? What do you mean by that? It's a mixture between Fire Pack and Krita since I just started using Krita. I'm still learning. Nice. Too much time in here. <laughs> yeah. Too much time. Especially for building communities and finding new people. <laughs> yes, real artists use MS Paint. You can only be a true artist if you use MS Paint. You'll never make it as an artist unless you use MS Paint. It does pay out. You, I see you around a lot, Haku, and I love hanging out with you, so I'm glad that you're here all the time. when I started using it, but it kept lagging and dragging my tablet and I got the bug. Yeah, I feel that. I, I've, I've heard that Krita has some bugs. I've only used it like very briefly and I liked using it then, but I haven't used it for long periods of time. Doesn't it sound dope? I, I don't know what it means, but it sounds cool. Like how would it be like a combat? Like, is it like a battle royale? Like the uh, critical role battle royales? D&D, like, playing D&D could definitely be a bracketed sport. I'm still forcing this. Yeah, you are. You are, Haku. Crazy person. Um, setting up a challenge two to three weeks in advance, like fighting a Hydra at 7th level, but no healing spells allowed, so that the players can then create characters specifically for that encounter, like a super meta D&D. Ooh, that'd be kind of cool. That sounds awesome.
Simpsons, like, so much fun. I just, I love the things that you guys come up with. You guys have such, like, an amazing imagination. I, I'm so impressed. I think it would definitely be fun to, like, do that and, like, have, like, brackets and things. I've heard that people really like brackets. I've never done that. Like, Mark Madness type of thing? I don't know. Daniel's a big sports nut, so maybe that's why I thought about it. This one really has me appreciating no nonsense boss battling again. Yeah, boss battling. I'm never I've never been really good at boss battling. To be honest. But I think it'd be fun in D&D for sure. It is a brush. Yeah, the pattern on her dress is a brush. It is a Kyle T brush. It's called... It's called J Daisy Chain. Yeah. This, so, like, this is what you... This is what it looks like... Oh, wait, that's white. So this is what it looks like if you, like, don't do anything, but if you, like, do... Use it, like, lightly. It, like, brings out this pattern. It is a brush. I'm really happy that I found that color, like, found this brush. Because it's really cool, and it makes really cool patterns on clothes. Without having to do much work at all. God, the nobody. Yeah, kind of. I went with the, like, I went with uh, Nico's idea of, like, having, like, the black bar, the black bar makeup. I'm really, I'm really digging it. I'm really digging it. All her different, all of her different, uh, styles. I'm really excited. So I've got this one, and then I'll have the one that um and then i'll have the one that i drew on procreate and then i'll have adela i'll have so many and they'll all be nobody even though they'll look different and that is cool because that's her whole thing and also for those of you that aren't aware i'm currently drawing a uh, character that i play in uh geek outs uh seattle 20 uh 2098 um, cyberpunk system game. Cypher system game. It is a cyberpunk setting, and it's super, super cool. Super, super cool. And I, uh, love it very much. And this was a commission that, uh, Geek Out spent 25,000, 25,000, uh, fairy dust points on. So, I'm doing my best for him. Go hog wild! Yes, go hog wild. This is the rave look. Yes, this is for uh, uh, the party.
This is specifically for, um, uh, Avery's party. My music stop again. Dang nab it. Yes, I'm still listening to music. There we go, and then... Now for the background. What should I do for the background? Hmm. Oh yeah. Ooh, multi-beams of teal and pink light. I do like that. I'll make the background darker. If I, I can give any errors, it's to loosen your wrist and scribble like the devil's after you. <laughs>
Okay, I can do that. Actually, how about instead of making that this the background, I'll make that the foreground. Oh, that's a good idea. That is a good idea, Nico. going good i'm still streaming i know yeah that's pretty thank I you i was watching you earlier oh thanks mostly mostly well i mean it was on and i was watching you draw i, I didn't have the, the know, sound up much it's fine i'm kidding i know i know Yes. Yes. Hey, my mom is here. Hello. My mom is here. She wanted. I love blue, pink, purple color lights. Yes, me too. Um, FYI, hmm. the cats are hanging with mom, daddy today. Oh, okay. Jeez, they don't usually <laughs> hang with me during the stream. <laughs> they pop in and they're like, "What are you doing?" <laughs> and then I make a big deal about it, and then they leave. Yeah. Cause they hate me. What I'm streaming because I can't pet them. Mm -hmm. They're like, you're useless. Yeah, I chase nothing more than people doing stuff when she wants to be petted. Yeah, she really <laughs> does. She really hates it. Oh, thank you so much for hanging out, Hannah. It was wonderful to have you. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye. Yes, I'll be streaming next Saturday. So if you're able to hop in, please do. Yeah, I know, right? We love disco feels here. Alright, now to add. Now 
now to add the fuzz effect. Downloaded Krita! Woo! Good job! You're up, you're back to a quick doodle amount of points? Goodness! You guys are insane! I'm at 34k, I could get a headshot with the Krita. You could! You could! I think that is the correct spelling, Nico. Hoarding them points. You are hoarding them. You're hoarding them for one day to just drop, make me drop everything and, oh, I accidentally moved the uh, alarm. Finished, but I want to learn something. So you put more lighter colors on the light part to make it more. Uh, so you put more light colors on the light part to make it more authentic. Um, yes. I'm not entirely sure what you mean by that. Um, but I, yeah, I try to make have it. Um. Yeah, light is usually filtered through lots of different wa ways, so like adding, even within light, having different gradients of like the light texture, um, generally helps. Um, so like having like, even if it's like not, even if it's not like sunlight, having rays of light usually really helps to like do that. And then um, when like, it's like a very intense light on a body you usually can like see patches on the body where um try touching up the very edge of the wood a light that would shine on her body from the back yeah um oh like from here like in this area yeah i was thinking of having like sort of like a glow over there Yeah.
Yeah, and usually when you put it on, like, a person has, like, light shining on their body, you can, like, for me, when, like, you can see, like, the light hitting me in certain areas, like, here, um, and, like, right here, so, like, it'll show up on the body, usually. That's sort of what I'm trying to... I'm gonna add, like, more pink areas in that area. To really accentuate that. And, like, here and on this side is gonna be a bit more... Have some more of a teal effect. clouds and I think I'll probably put the moon behind her as well Thank you. I'm glad you think this is amazing. Um, seeing how to do lighting effects and drawing is so fascinating. Yeah, I, I mean, I will not say that I'm an expert in lighting effects for sure. I've pretty much this is pretty much just me making it up as I go along, but um, it is honestly so much fun to do lighting effects, and it's really cool that you like did lighting in theater. That's really awesome. Yes, exactly. Really. I'm so weird. I can probably convey what I mean. Yes, that's what I thought you meant. Just a little bit. I'm gonna add that for the pink too. It's really cool that you did lighting for theater. You kind of just have to like figure it out as you go along. 
I, I'm also the moonlight. <laughs> yes, also the moonlight. You're right. I'll have to do some white as well. <laughs> You're gonna go to sleep? I completely understand. I hope you have a wonderful sleep, Morgan. It's been so awesome to have you here. As always, it's awesome to have you here. I hope you have a wonderful sleep, and I can't wait to see you the next time you decide to come and hang out. Bye! Have a great rest of your day, and please go to sleep well. I link the pretty jar lady one more time. Yes, please do it. Link all pretty draw ladies. All pretty draw ladies must be linked. I actually think this is good. What do you guys think? I'm actually kind of in love with this. This is beautiful. Man, lighting effects really elevate drawings, don't you think? The college took an intro to lighting design class and learned that it's a subject that I'm really fascinated by. Fall through with more, but I think it's yeah. Oh man, lighting effects is, are so cool. I love it. I'm so glad you think it's good. Ooh, that is such a pretty drow lady. <gasps> Ooh. Pretty drow lady. I love her. I love the pretty drow lady. <laughs> Thanks, Mango. Take away the pink shine on top of the pupils. Ah, yes. You're right. There we go. <laughs> That's, I mean, lighting effects is one of my favorite things to do in drawing. I, I usually don't draw things that don't have lighting effects because I just really, really want things to look cool. Um, so lighting effects was one of my things that I like truly, truly wanted to do. I think I need to add some, add some spot, add some spice to these curls. amazing <laughs> in my mouse to make oh really please play with lighting effects I love I it really elevates everything that you create even if it's just like super simple like this one is because it's just like two lights so I don't know I I'm oh I'm so excited I'm so excited to see everything improve with pretty dry ladies yes I'm also yelling about the setting she belongs to in the computer today my continue before sleep. Yes, your set your D and D setting is so cool. Your drow under dark D and D setting is beautiful. <laughs> Thanks, guys. All right. 
Yeah, the Kagoda Phoenix thing that you asked me to do was super fun. I really, I've been sitting too long. Um, it was so much fun. Time to save. Free just described the masterpiece as simple. <laughs> it's not okay. I'm not trying to like downplay how like what work went into this, but like for different lighting effects, it can get a lot more complicated. Like the Exio one um, was a lot more complicated because I had to um, do like hollow effects as well. Oh, I forgot to do the hollow effects. Crap, I should do that. Never mind. I'm not done. I forgot to do the hollow effects. <laughs> Nobody rave. Or like doing like spacescapes. That's like a lot of. Yes, Gina popped in during the Exio stream. Yes, please sleep more again. It is late. What you doing? There we go. And now there's hollow effects. Okay. <laughs> Good night, Morgan. All right, there we go. Now this is done. Hooray! Nobody is complete. That is the most different sense I've ever seen. Nobody rave. Nobody is complete. I hope you enjoy. I hope you enjoyed watching this, Geekouts, and thank you so much for spending your all of your uh, fairy dust points on this. I'm super happy with it. How are we still going? I don't think I'll be able to get Finn's one done in here. I plan on still doing it. It's gonna be in my list of things to do. Um, don't forget to drink. Hydration is key. Come on! Um, but I actually think uh, we might be ending pretty soon, unless you guys have... It was worth it for Finn. Oh, good. I still We still have 20 minutes. I do have to use the bathroom real quick, though, if we are going... If someone wants to uh, do another uh, quick doodle. Um, if anyone wants to do another quick doodle, please do so now, because we only technically have about 20, 15 to 20 minutes left in this stream. Um, so if anyone wants to do a quick doodle, uh, do it now, or forever hold your peace. Um, but for Fairy Dust Commissions, Finn, uh, did one also, and I'm going to be doing that probably next stream, um, which will actually, for fun fact, be on Tuesday. On Tuesdays, I am streaming from 4 to 7, and they will be art streams. I plan on doing, uh, Clear Skies fan art on, um, 
Tuesday, but I might be able to sneak in one of these. Sneak in, uh, sneak in a thing. What if quick break, then another, like, 30 minutes? Sure, I can do that. That sounds good. I'm gonna do, all right, I will do that. I will do a quick break and then, like, another 30 minutes. I can do that. All right, I have to use the bathroom again and fill up my water bottle, so we're going to take a very quick break. Don't go anywhere. It'll be, like, two to three minutes, I promise. Um, but if you need to use the bathroom, uh, get some more water, Paku, or, um, get a snack, please do so. I will see you in about, uh, three minutes. Break. Let's see if I can... I'm back. How's everyone doing? 
Um, just went to the bathroom real quick. Hopefully everyone's stretched. I did my wrist stretches. You know, good stretches, good shoulder stretches. Um, I'm sorry that the uh, audio just blasted for someone. I, for you guys, I don't know what that was. I was in the bathroom. Um, sorry about that. Uh-oh. That's an ad. That sounds like an ad. There we go. Back to the top. Hello. I was wondering why I was so quiet. I'm working on things too. Sweet! Yes, work on things, Hair Thulu. Yeah. Probably. Um, but yeah. I am back. Hopefully you guys are had a good uh, stretch break. Um, last little bit of some cold chai. Um, ooh, you have a short story to write. That's cool. Um, I could pro and also uh, Ninja Penguin. Just I saw that you said yay, Clear Skies fan art. Yeah, on Tuesday I'm hoping to do either. Clear Skies fan art of that epi of the month that Monday's episode, or um, doing fan art for um, doing finishing up the uh, Lacat and Doctor Yada fan art that I started. Ooh, Raptors from space! That sounds cool. Space and space and um, dinosaurs is a good mix. I like that mix. Um, but, and Kenny, if you're also still here, I just wanted to let you know that, um, I am working on your commission. Just wanted to let you know that I am starting the sketch and I should probably be done with that, uh, by the end of this weekend. So on Monday, you'll get an email from me with a, a sketch for the commission you asked for. Me! It's really fun so far. I'm really, I'm really happy with it. But, yes. Someone make Haku stay hydrated. They have to stay hydrated. Come on, Haku. Hey. All right. I'm gonna make this a PNG real quick. There we go. Yeah, I'm, it's, it's really fun. It's really, really fun. And speaking of commissions, I, this was not even supposed to be a segue, but speaking of commissions, if you are interested in commissioning um, art for me for anything, um, uh, I have my commissions open right now. Um, there is, uh, maybe one of my mods can probably put a link to it in chat, but if you are interested, you just fill out this form and uh, I will contact you when I have some time to do your commission. And it's usually probably within a few days. I I'm, I'm get back to it pretty easily. Yes, that is my commission sheet. Let me know if you can't open it for whatever reason, but yes. Um, just like the things you see me draw on here, like this bust, um, I will draw for you for money. I do busts, um, I do bust, full color busts for about 25, uh, K spare dust because only the people that are here all of the time get them really. And it takes a while, so it kind of like, it kind of equates. And I want to give back to you guys who are continually supporting me by being here. Thank you so much for being here, by the way. Like, streaming with you guys is always so much fun. I, I, and I'm just really happy I get to do art streams again. Because it's been, like, almost a month. Almost a month since I did... Ooh! Nigga redeemed a quick doodle. That's why you wanted to... Yeah, that's why you wanted it to be a thing. It's yesterday's tea. Well, at least you drink something. But yeah. Um, that is my commission stuff. What what do you want me to draw, Nico? What is the quick doodle you would like me to draw? Rocket-powered Nyx versus the agent. Oh, wow. That is a... a that's gonna be... Oof. That's gonna be difficult. That's gonna be difficult. Oh, jeez. Okay. 
We'll see how fast this is. This is a challenge. We're gonna end the stream on a challenge. All right. Okay. Do I have? A, I'm gonna find a reference. Oh, great doodle. <laughs> The thing about quick doodles is they're only within 20 minutes. So as much as I can get done in 20 minutes is what you're going to get. I'm going to try to finish it, but I did do uh, Mr. Penny's in 20 minutes. So maybe I'll be able to get this done. I don't know. Just a quick sketch. I know. I'm just, but I'm just trying to find a good. All right, that I think is a good reference. All right, we found a. Re I found a reference, and it's 20 minutes on the clock, starting, starting now. That's how legs work, right? That's how legs work, correct? <laughs> Three, two, one, honk! Exactly. Oh, thank you so much, Lucas, for hanging out. I probably will have to. I have, um, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, and I hope you have a very good time. Sorry, I can't. I love you, Lucas. Bye. Okay. 
That's what the, that's what it, that's what the agent looked like. Okay. Agent probably had longer legs. Yeah. Yes, go to go kick some dragon butt. Thank you for the references. I will look at them later. I also don't really remember what Nyx was wearing. I know that they were wearing basically like rockets, so. I know they were wearing pretty much like a morph suit. Proud of this pose, nonetheless. Flags, flags. I didn't have a jacket. Got it. I'm just gonna say that Nyx is gonna look so fucking hot. Hi, Mom. How are you doing? Fine. Okay, what are you- what Just are you... continue doing what you're doing. <laughs> Distracting me! Text me that too. They are the Dembo of our team. That is very true. That'll be the tie. shaking.
That's not what fire looks like. How could they not be hot? Exactly. Nick's, a, Nick's has to be hot. That I don't make the rules. I mean, yes I do. Because I'm drawing them for the first time. This is the first time they've ever been actually created. <laughs> but, whatever. Makes them look like they're wearing socks. That works. They could be wearing socks. Who knows? They kicked off their shoes during their fight. <laughs> how the agent looks. It's fine. I'll do the head first. Thank you, Nico, for the time. How do I? What does a fist look like? Hands, the bane of my existence. If there's one thing I've never gotten good at, it's drawing hands. A blob, exactly. Nyx has been created. That's the most important part. Now I'll work on this janky...
that how you hold the gun? No. Do I care? Not particularly. gun. Please ignore the janky agent. Please ignore the janky agent. God, it looks so janky. Better. But still pretty janky. Just look at Nyx. Nyx is cool looking. Just look at Nyx. How much money? How much time do I have left? Two minutes. Okay. This is the time of the show where instead we, of coloring. We just do lighting effects.
I think that's d oh 30 seconds. I think that's done. I'll just do this real quick. Ta da! Quick sketch. And that is a quick sketch, folks. That is as much as I can get done in 20 minutes. Poses are hard, y'all. Woo! Please pay attention to Nyx. And not... Maybe if I just, like... I could, like, crop it. But yeah, ta-da! I hope you enjoyed spending your 8,000 fairy dust, Nico. This was really fun. I actually really, in I really like how Nyx looks. I hate the agent, but I mean, <laughs> both characters. <laughs> Is it canon that I will 100% adopt? <laughs> You know, sometimes when you're drawing, you just accidentally create canon. Because you're like, I just don't want to draw shoes. That's impressive for 20 minutes. Thank you. <laughs> for their shoes. I don't know what happened to their shoes, but I love it. Well, when they were blasting off, they fell off. I mean, sometimes when you're running, your shoes just fall off. And that's what happened. They're somewhere. Yay! Cough, cough, 35 fairy. I mean, if you want to spend it, I can't, I do need to stop uh, streaming at some point. But if you would like to spend it, I, I still have a queue. So I will be able to go back and look at it and uh, know what you want me to draw. And then I can uh, do it on another stream. They didn't tie their shoes. <laughs> they did not. So she said, I mean, those things never stay. Exactly. They were dress shoes. So like, why would they why why would that be a thing <laughs> never mind that being a cartoon with a sudden increase in speed from the photo it literally blasted off <laughs> yes blasted them off i feel like yeah i'm glad that you like both characters i i'm i'm really proud of nix's pose i'm really I'm awaiting something. Okay, you're awaiting something. I am interested. But, um, I think with this, I'm just gonna, uh, file. Save. Nice fight. Sweet. I think, um, with this wonderful, uh, fairy dust commission i think that is the end of the stream um it is 7 20 um so i think i will probably have to get some dinner i have some dinner i gotta eat and uh some people i still have to email today so i need to consume food we will see what happens but Thank you all so much for hanging out today. We got to 20 viewers, which is the highest I've ever gotten. So thank you so much. Um, thank you also so much for just hanging out today. I had a lot of fun drawing. Thank you to uh, Nico and Finn and uh, Morgan and Matt uh, for uh, suggesting and spending your fairy dust for all of the commission work that I did today. Thank you so much. I uh, loved drawing nobody. Loved drawing Nyx. Mr. Penny's was really fun. And Finn, I'm really excited to draw your doll character. Yes, thank you also uh, for uh, thank a huge thank you to our mods, uh, uh, Drapanduin and Killer Haku, just so you guys know who they are in chat, for uh, using your swords ad admirably for the first time ever. So, thank you guys. That's so sweet. Thank you for always putting in links when I do things. Uh, just, you guys are amazing, and I'm so excited to be streaming on Saturdays again. So excited. Uh, I love streaming on Saturdays. <laughs> I love streaming art. Art streams are my favorite. I do like gaming streams, though, also. I just like streaming. I like you guys. I mean, what can I say? Um, but, 
uh, I will be streaming on uh, Tuesday. Uh, uh, I'm going to be doing Clear Skies fan art Tuesday from 4 to 7. Um, I will be streaming again on Thursday. I think we're playing Neverwinter next week. I can't remember. I think so. I think we're playing Neverwinter next week. So those of you that have Neverwinter, uh, we will continue to like level up and hang out in our guild. Um, and we actually, uh, you can actually have your voice on stream with me and we can have a good time. So yeah. Um, and then on Thursday, that's another from four to seven. I'm going to be, we're going to be playing Neverwinter. And then on next Saturday, uh, I don't remember what I said we were going to do. We're going to do something. But we're probably going, um, we're going to do something. Probably going to also do commission work as always. Um, and that'll be from three to seven. So those are the three days a week that I stream in March. Tuesdays is a test stream. We'll see what happens on Tuesdays, but um, I will see you all on Tuesday, and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day, whether it is super late at night, or early in the morning, or any of that type of stuff. I hope that you have a wonderful day, and I will see you all on Tuesday. Bye, guys. Uh, actually, wait. Should we raid anybody? I always say bye, and then I'm like, wait, raiding, because that's a thing that I should do. Um, is anyone live right now? Mm, oh, Shelsy Doodles. Uh, should we, uh, should we raid, uh, Shelsy Doodles? What do you guys think? Yes. Alright. Amazing. Hi, please. Uh, is that another amazing mark? Or Annabelle K. She's doing art. Okay, we can do Annabelle K. We've raided Shelsy Doodles before, but we could do Annabelle K. I will look her up. Annabelle. Okay. Sure, we can do that. Uh, we can read Annabelle K. Okay? Why not? Let's do, let's support some new people. Let's do it. All right. All right. I'm going to quickly just type in her name. All right. Get your honks ready, everybody. Let's go uh, raid some people and have some fun, all right? Alright, bye everybody, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, and I will see you all on Tuesday, and we are going to rate in 3, 2, 1, let's go!